this is me, and this is my husband, Brandon. In January 2019, we got engaged while on vacation in Florida. And 36 hours later, I found myself holding a completely unexpected positive pregnancy test. To say we were shocked is an understatement. Once we got a grip on the situation, we were excited. In September of 2019, we welcomed our beautiful baby boy, Cooper. Little did we know the surprises were just beginning. Cooper was born with a large patch of white hair among his otherwise dark hair. The day after he was born, we were told he hadn't passed his newborn hearing screening. While we didn't think much of it at the time, further testing revealed that Cooper actually has severe to profound hearing loss in both ears. The days following his diagnosis were not easy. I spent so much time wondering what his life would look like and how he would ever communicate with us. At eight weeks old, Cooper underwent testing that determined he was in fact a cochlear implant candidate. He also got hearing aids, but because of his level of loss, they did not help him hear at all. Even though he was a cochlear implant candidate, we decided to start learning American Sign Language as well. In June of 2020, Cooper underwent bilateral cochlear implant surgery. Everything went well and it was deemed a success. The next month, he got to hear our voices for the first time when his cochlear implants were activated. He started becoming much more vocal and we got to learn the joys of parenting a child with cochlear implants. There they go. In the last 15 months, there have definitely been some pretty hard and emotional moments for both of us. But there have also been moments like this, moments of clarity and recognition. He is excelling in both sign and spoken language, and every time he learns something new, my heart blows up. We have a long way to go in this journey, and I'm sure there are more hard days to come. But every single time I look at this sweet face, it makes every single step worth it.